Aha. Love at first sight. Well, near first sight anyway. And they lock hands in love. Then after the class, making like a making like the spider, making like electric hedgehog, <laughs> or a spider monkey or whatever. <laughs> uh, he swings her. He swings Simone. Wild swings Simone uh, over to his wild tree to his tree house. And Wild turns on to the power in his house, and he's like, <laughs> and she and Simone is impressed. <laughs> wow. Big confetti, we both build and tinker and construct. <laughs> yeah, Big C donated the mattress, battery, lights, and pillows, Wild says. But I built this tree house and furniture. <laughs> wow. Then Simone is like, oh, come on, you have to come see my pad then. So then they swing back over to Quickville in the, par in the park across in the mall. And it's like it's underground. Oh, please, don't take root here yet, Wild. <laughs> It's ten feet down to her ceiling from the mailbox. And then he, then they get down, and then she turns on the lights in there. Wild's impressed as well. <laughs> yeah, impressive. Huh. You're a constructor, huh? Got the PhD, got the degree and everything. Sweet. This is a layout of Wild Science's treehouse. What looks on the outside and the front? And then bird's eye view of the inside. And then you go underground to Simona's underground home. You might say her rabbit hole. <laughs> yeah, but she's not a rabbit. Yep. Okay. But now retracting to back out to, out to the class, uh, Layla just steps out of the university. She's looking, yeah, yeah, punchy punch. Yo. You can call me punchy. Huh. Call me dazzled. Eh, I'm Layla. Hmm. And then she da and then he dashes around her and he says, "Well, Layla, I have a bike and a sidecar. Let's paint an MCD red, white, and yellow." <laughs> oh yes. <laughs> oh, you know I prefer to exercise a lot by walking. It's okay. I'm sure your feet could use a break. Let's go. Mm. So then they ride on Punchy's motorcycle. To an MCD just a couple of miles away. So, at the, so inside they make their order. Mm. Punchy, Punchy says, Yeah, I'll have a number five grilled, no mayo, no salt on the freedom fries. And then and Layla says, Yeah, and I'll have a Caesar salad, pickles on the side, and a diet cola. Oh, and ranch dressing, please. <laughs> so then they get to their table and they're enjoying their meal. So Layla's punching on her salad, and Punchy offers her offers her a fry. Let's say, you know, hey, I'm a few fry. Ah, uh, come on. Hmm. Okay. Ah. Uh. Reginald's outside looking in that McDonald's. And he's sad. Hmm. But then suddenly, somebody taps him on the shoulder from behind. It's Angelica. Hmm. I've heard from Flo that you need a friend. So later at Quickfield Park, Reginald and Angelica got to talking. Hmm. Really? I feel for you. An important lesson from your, from your class that should be on a test is that you have to forget your fears and talk to the woman before she can be swept away by anyone else. Yeah. Anyway, thanks for listening. Layla was cute. But I guess I'll get over it. Could pray too, Angelica, but you probably wouldn't go out with me. Oh, nonsense. I think you're sweet, handsome, and honest. I would love to continue hanging with you. Really? Wow. Would you like to have dinner at my place tonight? Sure. I'd love that. Wow. <laughs> and then she reaches over for his claw. And then they look into each other's eyes and take a moment to have, take a moment to smile at each other. But they're not the only ones at the Quickville Park. Nearby are Punchy and Layla on the bench at the far side. And in the middle, it's Wild and Simona. <laughs> and Simona says to Wild, Can this really work, Wild? You're electric. I'm grounding your grass. I don't care, Simona. 
I love you, no doubt about it. Oh, Wild, I love you too. And then they all just enjoy the sunset. Yay. Off behind him in the distance, uh, Ivy enjoys the sunset as well from the rooftop of Quickville Shopping Center. Hmm. I pray for your safe voyage to me. I will wait for you. As God and Jesus has guided me too. Boom, 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 boom. But on, okay, let's now Tuesday, May sixth, two thousand eight, the final exam of the of date three o three. But fortunately, it's not Miss Jack Ress that comes today. It's her sister. Good morning. I read to Jack Ress, Sarah's sister. <gasps> I, I, I'm sorry. My sister, she recently passed away in an automobile accident with truck. But sis, tell me a lot about you all in the class. I'm capable of issuing exams and grave an answer key. Uh, I'll get over this. Come on, come on, get over this, girl. Okay. I was impressed with successful love relationships that have developed in the class. I hope y'all stay well from sis's teachings. I wish y'all good luck on exam and future in your individual relationships. Please kick in. The individual students took the exam and they each got the results in the mail a week later. Hmm. Between our between our main characters, uh, Simone like got 99%, uh, Layla got 97, Ivy got 99, Reginald got 98, Wild got 98, and Punchy got 100. Hmm. Everybody else got good grades. The uh, lowest scoring one, unfortunately, was this guy named was this Clyde Raymond in the far corner. Well, that's what you get for sitting in the back row. You don't get to learn as much. Stay tuned for the next episode.